so my name is Marissa and my final presentation is called It's Just a Joke, Examining Oppressive Humor. And so I started out with an agenda on my Prezi. So I'm talking about my problem. I have some video clips um, and a discussion. And then I have a couple different um, articles that I brought from the internet. One of them is called Rape Jokes versus Murder Jokes Discussion. One is uh, some borrowed guidelines and then um, our thoughts and then final questions. So my problem, it's kind of a diff couple different parts. Um, so I've been told a lot of times that I can't take a joke um, from various people. So I hear things and I know that people mean them to be funny, but in my head I either find it offensive or I know somebody might find it offensive. So I have this internal dialogue of whether I should say something and be the one who ruins the joke or not say something and be the one who just lets this go on. Um, and then also, is it okay to laugh? So if, is it okay if I turn on... Um, South Park or something, and is it okay for me to laugh because I know that it's bad, but I'm taking, you know, I'm taking my mind out of it and just laughing. So I struggle with that. Um, something else that I just kind of find interesting is when people tend to justify, including myself, justify when they tell these types of jokes, like, oh, it's okay, my, my, my girlfriend thinks it's funny, so it's okay if I make jokes about women or things like that. Um, people tend to justify because they don't want to be in trouble. Um, and then also, lastly, sort of like what is considered oppressive versus anti-oppressive. So if I see a message and I consider it to be oppressive, but somebody else doesn't, is it really? Or how is that affecting people? Um, so then I have some different video clips. And in my handout, I'm asking people to just sort of take notes after each one. Uh, so the first, oh, I don't have notes on the first one. One of them is about a man who was talking about a situation with his girlfriend. It's a comedian. Um, it's called PMS and red wine, and um, just talking about how women, when they are PMSing and they drink red wine, and he compares them to being a witch. Um, and then there's another comedian who talks about um, gay neighborhoods and how his neighbors are gay. And then the last video clip, why, I can't remember off the top of my head. Oh, could not save your Prezi. Okay. Just a minute here. Technical. Technical issues. Okay. Okay, so then I ask people to take notes and then we can kind of have a group discussion afterwards. I would show them to you, but they're all a couple minutes long. So, um, next. So, just discuss what they wrote down in a small group. What were your thoughts, feelings, or reactions to the videos? Just to sort of see um, some dissonance within people, like being able to point out if something's wrong or not wrong, or if it's okay to laugh or not okay to laugh. After that, I have um, an article that someone wrote from um, the New Statesman called Rape Jokes versus Murder Jokes. Um, and it sort of compares how, like, would you tell a murder joke if you knew that that many, like, more people had been murdered in that room or had been affected by murder, and just sort of comparing the two um, and how people will say, oh, it's okay to tell a rape joke if you know no one in the room has been affected by rape and that kind of thing, just sort of breaking down when it's okay and if it's okay to even have these sorts of guidelines. Um, and then a discussion about whether we agree or disagree. Um, and then I have two different sets of borrowed guidelines um, on identity-based humor and conditions for an anti-oppression joke. So the first is like what it's okay to make fun of and um, a lot of them, or both of them come up with things like it's okay to make fun of it if there's somebody else there, either in the clip or like in the joke that's questioning it. So if I say um, something that's racist and somebody says that's racist, then it could be okay. That's what this, some of these guidelines say. Um, and then they also say things like, it's okay if it's coming from a member of that group or not coming from a member of that group or is it not okay at all. So just some sort of um, things I borrowed from different sites about their conditions for what's okay and not okay and then um, discussing those. Um, and then lastly, just discussing what we think after reading all this. Um, have you changed your mind? What do you think is okay when talking about humor? Um, and any questions that people are left with? And that's all.